The sold-out crowd at Toyota Stadium at Worldwide Technology Soccer Park was a buzz when St. Louis FC hosted the Tulsa Roughnecks FC. Kicking off the final homestand of the 2018 regular season, two matches and four points are all that stand between St. Louis FC and their first playoff berth in franchise history. Could the boys deliver a massive result and take one step closer towards that postseason goal? Let's go to the highlights and find out. Their status still unknown as Anthony Pulis and St. Louis FC looking for a massive three point. Corner kick lofted in towards the back post, nodded in, and it's batted off the line by Serda. Early massive save for the Chilean keeper. And another corner kick coming up. Keeping St. Louis out. Here's that save, it was so quick, the goalkeeper. There we go, Dick would just readjust his body. Good work from Gamble. Turns a couple St. Louis defenders, slides it along. Tulsa are in business. Knocked across, Gomez got a touch to it. It'll fall towards the back post. Whipped in, and Vukovic was not far Dealing off. With the irritant, Albert Dikwa. It's e. Tavares, just trying to create a little bit of separation, quite literally. Lewis Hilton towards the back post again. Fink nods it forward. Kavita, and it's tapped home. Corey Herzog. It's a terrific start for St. Louis in one of the biggest matches of the season. Let's have a look. Straightforward ball into the box. One by St. Louis, one by St. Louis. Three times, three touches. Corey Herzog just finishes it off brilliantly. Or do, or do they mean U.S. soccer national team? I, I would take it. Colbertson, good ball in. Herzog, oh. what a save from Serda. Herzog was looking for the double, and Baby and Serda with yet another terrific save. He's been phenomenal in the opening 20 minutes. Virtually, there he goes, and Serda, brilliant save. Nice and athletic from the goalkeeper. Tony Walls, Maybe just a little bit too long. Gamble got a foot to it. And Kavita. Finding Dequa the other way. Albert Dequa in on goal. Dequa couldn't quite get enough on it. Oops. Here's Kalistri off the Tulsa turnover. Joey Kalistri. Not the best decision. Able to win it back, though. For two, it is bounce. Now it's Dakers. Kadeem Dakers off oh. the post. He had Gomez beat. Have a look at the game. Dakers cuts in. It's a keepers are standing there watching. Oh, so close there. Team Dakers been really good on that left side. Hilton knotted down by Tony Walls and saved again by Serda. Once again, a free header in the box for some Dakers. Sending Dequa the other way. Albert Dequa onside. Dequa, what a challenge from Jusinho on a yellow card. Had to get it right. He did, and then some. Final whistle and three points in the bag for St. Louis. Well, that's the only thing the St. Luligans want to hear right now. Last touch off of Paris G. That's going to do it full time. St. Louis hang on for a 1-0 win. A massive result as you're trying to close out the season here and clinch a playoff berth. What's your immediate reaction to the match tonight? Pleased, obviously. I mean, it's obviously a huge win. I think coming in tonight, that was the focus was to do what we had to do, which was get a win. Not always nice to get a shutout as well, and it keeps the home streak going, but still work to do. I play to win every single game. I don't care about ties or where the table is. Like, we need to just concentrate on the next game, which is OKC. Tomorrow we need to come in and prepare and do whatever it takes to win, because no, no team, no true professional should ever want to play for a tie. Your goal, a little bit of a ping pong play off the corner. Talk about what you saw develop in there. Yeah, I mean, we worked on it on Friday, the day before the game, just trying to get Sam in the back post, and I think he won about five or six of those. So um, when one comes off like that, can't, can't complain. And we need your help more than ever to pack the park for Saturday, the final game of our season when St. Louis FC can clinch a playoff berth with a tie or a win when we host Oklahoma City. It's a 7.30 p.m. kick. Get your tickets now at stlouisfc.com. They won't last. On behalf of all of us here at St. Louis FC TV and the rest of the Flirtily Faithful, thanks for watching.